Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Mintraft, and today I am going to be showcasing my UNSC Artemis from Halo. But again, I have not launched this in a while, so I'm sorry if I if it takes a little while to um properly launch. So if I'm correct, seven, no, eight, nine, zero, um, three, two. I think three and two do something. Yeah. Oh yeah, four and three to close this. So this is the UNSC Artemis. I made this when, look at this now, I made this when this was a single digit of five. So this was, a, this was about a year or two ago. I made it a few days after I began playing the game properly. I don't actually have many of my old builds, but I have a few, okay. So the reason I've made this is because the reason I made this is because I was really in Halo and I still am. So this has no guns yet. I was planning on making gun. Um this is um shifting control doesn't actually do much apart from the drift which works doing. So if you're aiming upwards, you can do shift and control. If I'm correct, this can hit Mark 1. This can hit Mark 1. I'm pretty sure if I let it go on for long enough, it can probably hit Mark 2, which is twice the speed of sound, so I'd say about 3,000. I'd say about 2... 2,000 would be about Mark 1. No mark to, I mean. After I see how fast this can go, I'll give you the um, sh proper showcase of it. So... Now you may say this is quite an improper way of testing it. And yes, you can see that the inside, aka the only escape pod in here at the moment. I actually have um, special controls for this. Right, now if I press 1 again and I do this. Right, anyway, um, this is the NFC Artemis, as I was saying. And we're going to see what is the top speed for it. Well, as we can tell at the moment, um, it it seems to be going 800. About 800 is the top speed. Well, you can go faster. Anyway, um, anyway, um, let's just get this flipped. This is before I used to use locking on my belts, and I haven't actually done that yet. Um, anyway, um, let's have a look. So the interior, we go down here to exit kind of holes there. I might actually remake the Artemis or um, make another Halo ship. So then, cafeteria. More engines. I actually revamped this a few months back. Control, one of the control centers. Up here is the um, cryo sleep pods. L to move them up, K to move them down. Or, no, is this to move them down? Yeah. There's a semicolon to move it down. Through here, sleeping quarters with customly made beds. And down here is this again. You walk here, here's a door. Here is command center. Here is the rescue seat. Up here. I open this leads to the engines 
so you can do maintenance on the engines. We're right here at the moment, where the engines are. Yep, both of them can be found in here. And then here's the, um, the dock bay, as I called it, where you can view. So here is the exact same as on the other side, just the other one. And apart from that, that that's basically the whole um, showcase, apart from this part. So you walk up, now I'm not going to do it here because I want to showcase it landing. I'm actually, I actually was, I'm actually working on a more compact port for this. This is like my least compact one. And these are ODST pods, by the way. If you don't know what they are, they're marine pods in Halo. As they're called ODST. Normally. Look, there's an entire game based on playing as the ODST. It's called Halo 3 ODST. It's the second half of um, Halo 3. You should definitely check it out. This is not a plug to um, the creators of Halo. This is just trying to get people to play old games. Old games. Maybe even older than them. Yes, and I know you're going to say, but Halo Infinite is new. Right, okay, this is off track. Um, sometimes the controls can be a bit um, annoying to use. I can't help that. That's just um, the game's physics. So I'd say here. So I think it's F3, F2, no it's F1, wait what, no, G. I did it wrong but whatever. So W, D, A, W, E, T, then you can press 1 and watch that for. You can press 2 again to click the parachute, if you really want. Boing. And then normally you can get out. And that is the showcase, and I have a few more showcases coming up today, so I'll see you all later. Bye!